Hey y'all, Tom, ND3N here. Uh, and I'm gonna show you how to set things up for your best audio using your new FT-991A. The Yesu models, starting with the FT-9000 and all the way up through the 101, which include the FT-991A, use the exact same parametric equalizer. The menu items are different, but the levels are all the same. So, if you're looking for how to set up a Yesu and you have something that fits into those parameters, you can use this, but you're gonna to have to go to your owner's manual to figure out where in the menu list they are. Uh, since our phone signal is only 3000 Hertz wide, we only need three filters. We're not running a sound studio here. Now, we need them for the low end bass, the mid frequency, which is where you get your articulation, and the high end, which is where you get the crispness to your voice. Uh, we've all heard folks on the air with badly set audio. Uh, they have way uh, too much emphasis on the bass, hardly any mid frequencies where the important stuff really happens and very little high frequencies to speak of so you don't hear the inflections these voices sound mushy and they're sometimes difficult to decipher especially when you're trying to work at dex station and, and get through the uh, language barrier and the accents what we want to achieve is a nice balance of supporting lows articulated mids and crisp highs. The settings I'm gonna show you work well for me, but as always, your mileage may vary depending on the microphone you're using, <laughs> the way you usually use your microphone, your voice, your radio, many other things. So, consider these settings as a starting point then tweak them to give you, you, your best output signal for you. The first and most, most important adjustment will be the transmit bandwidth. On the 991A, this is menu selection 110, which I currently have set to 400 to 2600. Uh, you use 400 to 2600 if you're doing DX or contest work. For everyday conversations, Select that and adjust it down to the 100 to 100 to 2900 setting and we'll enter that. Now we're going to set our filters, our equalizers, and we have three equalizers and the first menu setting is on 119. So there it is and I'll back it up. Uh, you want this one to be set for 200 hertz. Right now I have it set for 300, but that was so I could show you how to change it. You go in there, you select it, you move it down to 200, and you hit enter. This is the center frequency of that equalizer. Um, now we're gonna go to uh, menu 120, which is uh, parametric equalizer level. This is either a boost or amplification or a notch or attenuation. In this case, we're going to attenuate the low by 9 dB. Uh, menu 121 is set to five, uh, a bandwidth of five. Now we go to our mid-level. This equalizer two, we'll bring all three up. You can see I've got my uh, Center frequency set at 900 hertz. Uh, we're going to slightly attenuate this by 3 dB uh, across the, that particular equalizer. And again, our uh, equalizer two on uh, menu item 124 is a five. Finally, our highs uh, starting in, uh, at menu item 125 we're going to set that to 2200. We're going to amplify that signal by 6 dB. And 127 will have a uh, bandwidth of 5. 
That completes everything you need to do on the menu, but there's one more thing we have to do. Uh, we'll get out of the menu, go into our FM list, and you'll see here the mic equalizer. It's the uh, one right next to the back button in the center. Uh, that has a selection of either on or off, and you want to turn that on which will engage all of those settings you just just made. If you want to use voice processing, which I don't recommend, but is your choice, use menu settings 128 through 136 and enter the same values as normal settings. Now let's discuss a couple of other basic settings for your rig. I won't be demonstrating these as I don't want to go on the air to make these kind of adjustments. I think that's kind of poor form. For normal transmissions, that's not using the voice processor, which we will discuss momentarily. And as a normal part of the operations, occasionally go over, set your meter to the ALC reading. Uh, you can bring up the FM uh, list and press the mic selection uh, while speaking in a normal tone and volume of voice. Adjust your microphone level until the ALC is reading towards the top, but not exceeding the ALC indicator bar. Too low and your microphone uh, and your audio system will not have enough oomph to drive your radio. Too high and your voice will start clipping and sounding choppy. Now once you've done that, and only if you want, you can adjust your voice processor. Note. This setting depends on a good ALC first, so make sure your ALC is set where it's supposed to be. You know, so set your meter uh, to display the compression meter or comp. Then bring up uh, the DM list uh, display in and uh, select the processor while observing, which is on there as PROC, P-R-O-C. Uh, while observing the compression meter, speak again in a normal voice and adjust the compression using the multi-knob so that the meter is indicating between mid to high deflection. I have found on rare occasions uh, when I've actually used a voice processor that a setting of five is more than sufficient. Again, your, <laughs> your mileage may vary. The goal of using the voice processor is to give yourself just a little extra kick, not to sound like a C beer with an amplified microphone. The instructions to set up for normal SSB and AM can be found in your owner's manual uh, on page 61, and instructions for setting the voice processor can be found on page 68. I hope you found this of some value. We all want to have the best signal that we can uh, have going out over the air, and these uh, settings will help you towards that goal. Always at your service, I'm Tom, ND3N, and thanks for dropping by my little shack in the corner, back there, for a ham shack chat. Remember, likes don't cost you anything, and it only takes a moment to click that thumbs up button. Uh, Please share this with your friends who may find the content of interest. As I noted in the beginning, starting with the A2, Yesu FT9000 through the 101, these settings and methods can be applied. However, the actual menu items will differ between the different rigs. 7-3 for now, I'm Tom, ND3N, and I'm out.